I'm joined now by Jeremy Wilkes, Euronews space correspondent. Jeremy, 60 years old, third time in space, quite an achievement. It's a massive achievement. And of course, at that age, a lot of people are thinking about retirement. They're thinking about looking after their garden. Paolo's going to go up to space and go and spend five months in space. A lot of people are asking about his health. Is that going to have an impact on him? Um, actually, of course, somebody who's an astronaut is in great physical shape. He was in the military beforehand. He's been to space twice already. Physically, he's in great, great great condition. But the question is, yes, what will happen to his body during that time that he's in space? We'll only really know when he comes back down in five months' time. Third time, as we've already said. Do you think he's made any special preparations this time? Well, he said, actually, when we spoke to him about this mission, that he was going to try to enjoy it because they've got an awful lot of tasks to do up when they're up there. He's looking after 50 experiments. He's got to look after the International Space Station together with the other crew members. But he said he's going to try and enjoy it. Look out the window. Enjoy floating like Superman. He's also said that he's managed to prize a little toy from his boy that he's going to be using in the Soyuz capsule as a kind of indicator of where they are, the weightlessness that they have. So there's a nice little personal touches like that that he's able to bring into this mission. Well, best of luck to Paolo and thanks to Jeremy for joining us.